Go Cardinals! We beat LA! Woo! Yeah, zero Super Bowls. Uh, anyway. Raiders, dog. Oh, a Raider fan Raiders. now. A Raider oh, fan. Well, Raiders is. Raiders is. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Fango Media, a platform for you, the fans, to voice your opinions and thoughts of all your favorite sports teams around the country. I'm Anthony Remedios, outside of State Farm Stadium, where the Arizona Cardinals dominated the Los Angeles Rams in week two of the NFL season in their home opener, a 41-10 victory. Marvin Harrison Jr. was the breakout star of the game, earning his the first two touchdowns of his NFL career. Two touchdowns, 130 rushing yards, and four receptions to the, this afternoon. Let's hear what the fans had to say. Go Cardinals! I'm feeling the vibes. I'm feeling good. Arizona did it today. Game today from last game is going to define what they're going to do this year. They're going to do it this year. And this game is, sets it all off. What part What part of the game frustrated you the most? The rest counted a dead ball as a touchdown, and then they let them get the conversion. And I saw an obscene amount of uncalled penalties for the Cardinals. Uh, hopefully Matt Stafford can get his aim up. I saw him hit someone on the helmet a few times. A new quarterback. Uh, yeah, I, I, I gotta say Trevor Lawrence. <laughs> or Justin Herbert. Rams forever. Rams for life. All right, so first of all, you're a Dallas Cowboys fan here at a Rams-Cardinals game in Arizona. What what brought you here to this game today? Well, we've got season tickets for Cardinals games, and you know, we're not only Cowboys fans, we're just football fans, so it's going to be a good time. Big fantasy football fan. I'm projected to go 0-14 this year, so <laughs> I was not expecting a Cardinals blowout. I want to see Kyler have an absolute cook sesh next week. Well, you mentioned Kyler. Kyler threw for three touchdowns. We have a Cardinals fan with the Kyler Murray shirt. Today. I felt like Kyler played amazing. I felt like he had a great game, had the offense going. It was absolutely awesome. So I'm not sure why a Cowboys fan is talking in a Cardinals game. I figured he would come out this week. I thought he would have a big game. Had great grabs, had two touchdowns, had some great catches this week. So that's what I thought Marvin would do this week. So I'm wow, super like excited. Raiders, dog. Oh, a Raider like fan Raiders. now. A Raider fan. Well, Raiders, 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 Raiders did get the win over the Ravens today. Alvin Kamara, dog? Lamar who, though? You know what I'm saying? Lamar Yes, sir. Lamar yes, sir. I'm about to get Raiders. Hey, have you ever seen a Cowboys fan and a Raiders fan? I have not. Not together. Right. Sure. And we have yeah. the Cardinals and Rams game. I'd be the craziest <laughs> But you know what? <laughs> get Raiders. Or Rams. Go Bears. <laughs> we beat LA. Woo! I, I. I don't know how I feel because I'm so used to the Rams beating our ass. So to, to walk out of this game and we actually won, I'm like, I'm kind of beside myself. Marvin Harrison Jr., people are down on him after the first game. One catch, four yards. His first two catches this game, two touchdowns. Come on. The man is, I'm telling you, he's, he's like, he could be our next uh, Larry Fitzgerald. Bro, I'll tell you what, there, there's so many K1 haters out there. But I believed in this kid the entire time. Yeah, he's short. I'm short. I love the short people. And he's killing it on the field. He did stuff nobody else did his first two years in the NFL. Had the knee injury. And now he's back. And he's proven to everybody. This kid's going to be an MVP. He's going to lead this Cardinals team to a Super Bowl one day. Everybody knew this Cardinals offense had explosive power. But the defense, everybody was down on them. Bunch of nobodies. And they showed up to play. They did their job, they were in the trenches, they were like beating that. I know the Rams line is, is beat up, but still, the Cardinals D came to play, and God bless them. Hey, Arizona, baby, watch out, we're NFL. We're coming, baby, don't be scared, because when we come, oh, watch out, baby. Watch out, brothers. <laughs> hey, watching the offense, man. Watching the offense. <laughs> hey, Brian Chung, you can't be mad at that, though. You can't be mad at that, guy. <laughs> Tom Brady, you can't be mad at that guy. The way Har uh, Marvin Harrison Jr. got all them bubble guts out and started making some plays. Hey, K1, watch out, NFL, because here comes Kyler. When you get them all... Super you... Bowl, baby, Super Bowl! Playoffs, but still. 
think they lost. <laughs> See a lot of injuries on the offensive line, not giving uh, Stafford, you know, any time right there. You know, hey, got to hand you the cards. Uh, I think uh, during the McVay era, we're seven and zero over here, now seven and one. Congrats to you guys! Great defense. Buda Baker was all over the field. That's not our day today. Yeah, it was rough, a long season. So you know, uh, good luck to you guys, and uh, better luck to us. But cherry on top. The 49ers lost in <laughs> Boo, 49ers. Boo. Yeah, am I right, everybody? <laughs> <laughs> Cardinals anyway. all day, baby. Yeah, zero Super Bowls. Uh, anyway. And there you have it, folks. The Arizona Cardinals defeating the LA Rams 41 to 10 in their home opener, improving to one and one on the season. For more of our content, please subscribe to us on YouTube at Fango Media and follow us on Instagram at Fango underscore media. Again, we are a platform for you, the fans, to voice your opinions. So please let us know in the comments what stood out to you about these two teams in week two. I'm Anthony Remedios, and I'll see you all again next week when the Detroit Lions come to town. Take care.